The way colors work in the digital realm is that they are additive. In other words, you add colors together to create white. It's the opposite of the print realm where you use inks. That's a subtractive color space where if you take all the inks away, you're left with a white page. But in additive color space, you add the colors together to get white. So let's check this out. I'm going to close the OS 10 color picker. I'm going to select all three of these shapes. And in the video inspector, I'm going to scroll down to the blend mode and change the blend mode to these three to add. Once I do that, we can see in the overlapping areas two additional colors, yellow and cyan. Because they overlap in additive blend mode, the values of the pixels are added together and create new colors. These are the secondary colors, and there's actually three of them. If I move the playhead forward in time, you'll see I can rearrange these three circles to overlap so that each overlaps the other. In the very middle, we get white. So if we add all three primary colors together, red, green, and blue, we get white. If you just add two of the primary colors together, you get the secondary colors, which are magenta, cyan, and yellow. These are very, very important to understand because if you have something that has a blue cast, you would actually add yellow to the blue in order to remove it and get closer to white. Another way to think of these secondary colors is that they are complementary to a specific primary color. So yellow is the complementary color to blue, and you can see how it's across from blue. Magenta is the complementary color to green, and cyan is the complementary color to red. 